My name is Lazaro Bosch. I'm a first year student at the Miami Dade Kendall campus. I was born and raised here in Tam Miami, specifically in the trailer park, University Lakes by Hometown America. Well, along with my family, uh, it was actually pretty shocking. It's the first time we ever evacuated. We didn't evacuate in previous time. Like my grandparents evacuated for Andrew, and my grandparents didn't either. My, uh, my family, I was, I was very young. My, sister, my youngest sister was just like two or three years old, like a baby. We didn't evacuate for Katrina Roma. It was the first hurricane we had to evacuate, especially how massive the storm was for Irma. Um, it was very shocking and a little unsettling, a little uneasy because my parents thought that, and my grandparents thought we weren't gonna come back to a home. Especially at the time, we, the storm was projected to hit us directly. And my parents were like, we need to pack as if we're, uh, as if we're never gonna see our items or we're gonna lose everything. So we just start packing as much clothes as we can. And luckily if it wasn't for a family member, uh, they were able to rent us a U-Haul storage unit by Dayland. That was the only one available. And we were able to pack the day before the storm stuff. And my grandfather has a van and my parents have the Nissan and they were able to pack as much as we can in the car, but we did the best we can. We had to leave still a lot of stuff behind. The damage, it was, it was, it was very hard for us. I know my grandfather uh, came to tears. Um, I was even during the storm, I went to bed the first night, uh, the, it was Friday night when we had evacuated at the friends, our friend's apartment. We were just, I, I, I called a good friend of mine. I was just, I broke down I, on the phone. I'm like, you know, I don't know what to expect. You know, we're, I don't know how the house is doing. My grandparents are split up. We've never been split and I don't know how they're doing. And the house, I, I just hope the be for the best for all of us. And we came home on Monday morning after they cleared up some debris in order for us to get here. And by the time we got here, we are just shocked. We saw debris everywhere and we couldn't get to the backyard. We saw some neighbors luckily. And we, that's when it really shined to see our neighbors come together and help us through this because there was just debris and branches everywhere. And there was stuff on our roof and we just saw holes in the walls. And we were just thankful that the house was still standing, but we were upset on how much damage it caused because after we were a bit more relieved since we saw the storm wasn't gonna hit us directly but we didn't expect for this type of damage and we're just hoping especially that we don't have home insurance we were now we have to see how we move forward but at least we're all safe this has been Lazaro Bosch first year student at Miami Dade Kendall campus I wish everyone a quick recovery from all the debris and the whole aftermath of Hurricane Irma